Hey everyone, Zero Jetty here with the X-Play Fans Channel. Here you go, quick taste of Mega Aquarium, a theme park sort of management sim where you take care of a uh, aquarium. So this is a uh, this is like the second uh, sort of story stage, but I wanted to show this one off mainly because I kind of I'm kind of established here. As you can see, I got my tanks with my fishies in them. If I get close, I can see them. I got a grouper over here, and then a whole bunch of these little fish. I have a here, I got a hermit crab tank over here, which is hermit crabs. And I can kind of run around and look at them and all my stuff. My, I got a big more eel down here. Where is he? He's hiding back there. But as you can see, like, I'm just kind of taking care of this aquarium. Yeah, get out of there. Nope. Nope. Get out back. Weird. There you go. And as you can probably notice, like, all these aquariums have stuff in them and the fish. And I have to attach, like, requirements for them. Ooh, excellent. I just got a new uh, research project. So there's a... Yeah, don't care. Uh, there's a lot to take in. Uh, the tutorial is very, very good, but it boils down to that. Hey, you make these uh, little tanks. You then supply them with fish, and then the fish sometimes have requirements, like some can't be with other fish. Or some are like bullies and can't be with wimp fish. That, um, that puffer fish sort of thing I just got was a wimp fish, so I couldn't have him with a certain type of other fish. Uh, the groupers and eels will eat smaller fish, so I can't have a fish under a certain size with them. And then each fish, let's go over to this, has like all this information. Let's see, this grouper here, like he has to have caves, he's greedy, and he dislikes uh, uh, his own species and kind of stuff. As you can see, he gets, he's warning, he can eat other fish and all that kind of fun stuff. And it's all explained very well. I just got these hermit crabs, which allow me to, uh, allow me, they give you extra like filtering so I have here this like filtering and heating unit and they need to kind of be connected. Uh, they also have to be hidden because people don't like seeing them. That's why I got these pumps and I got these like one, these glass tanks here that are in the wall. So I can kind of tuck the stuff up next to it. And then I got staff taking care of everything. But uh, I'm going to actually, I've actually uh, want, been wanting to expand a little bit. So we're going to actually go this way. Uh, the directional pad is all these different menus here up down for this one down here left so first this is like research and uh, ecology those are how you earn new things and you get those from specific things in your tank like hey if you have this stuff in here it generates research points when people view it sort of thing so it's kind of neat very well explained in the tutorial highly 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 suggest you do the tutorial so let's uh expand uh, expanding is dirt cheap in this game can't remember which way I kind of expanded last time so here maybe we're gonna go go this way and then we're gonna go and take this and I'm gonna do something a little different than I normally do I usually don't do these uh oh I forgot I need to build oh I don't want that almost went bad there you go. So I got that wall there. So now what I want to do is we're going to make a lagoon tank. So like I said before, the people don't really like to see like your equipment and stuff. So I recently researched pumps, which I can place here and then attach there. So now all I got to do is just throw this down next to it. As you can see on the right there, it requires a temperature of 70 and then there's a go in here water quality is 100% so the filter helps that and so do crabs and then we'll just double pump it since I'm about to leave here anyways and then I can go into the process of hey I want to buy let's put a more eel right in there but as you can saw there saw there he wants shelter so we gotta build a little shelter for him put that in the corner there we'll give him some uh seaweed to enjoy we'll just put a whole bunch in there it's not expensive he'll love it look how tiny he is and of course then the zookeeper the uh, aquarium keepers will take care of him and feed him and all that kind of fun stuff people will come and visit but yeah i've actually beaten this level so let's go on to the next level i think this game's pretty neat Actually, let's go to the sandbox and see what's up. 
Hmm. Okay, let's do creator mode so we can just kind of play around. Kind of see all the goodies that you have unlocked. So what do we have? What type of tanks? Oh boy. U tanks, specialty tanks. Chicago tank. That's kind of neat. What type of fish do we have? Oh boy. And you got to unlock all these. Where's the shark? Yeah, there's the sharks. Got rays, eels, seahorses. Oddballs. Oh, turtle. Coral. Neat. What other equipment is there? Nitrate reactors, UVs. Look at these super filters. Heaters, chillers, lights. Auto feeders, that'd be fun. Look at all these decorations. Look at all this cool stuff. What type of tools can you get? Sponge sink. And of course, gift shops and other attractions and fun stuff like that. But yeah, you get the idea. It's it's a very much a theme park kind of game. So let's just get a just a giant ton of room and just see what we can do. Ooh, got really close there. Oops. Let's make a U tank. Oops. Place that there. Uh, let's expand a bit more so I can at least put. Uh, do that what can we put in here can we put a shark in there can we let the kids play with the shark oh, I know lionfish excellent and then we're gonna let the kids come in and touch them we're gonna get the let's see this, this is we're not gonna this would not be really normally how I'd be kind of running through this Where's my super filters? Chillers, pumps, lights. Where's my filter at? There you are. There it goes. Uh, they don't like it that there's nothing there and they eat mussels. So of course, when you have a certain fish, you actually have to go in. I already told you about that one. You have to go to tools and then you gotta be like, hey, these guys need this sort of food. And then the your your team will take care of it. Let's go ahead and hire four staff and then we'll open. Come and touch the lionfish. It'll be great. But that's like the quick kind of overview that you have to build stuff. So let's actually back out. No, we're actually going to keep... Let's 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 keep this going. But yeah, that's Mega Aquarium. You're, like I said, I gave you a quick run through of like what's kind of required for the tanks. You saw those numbers kind of going. So if I kind of go like that... Yeah, cool, cool, yes. As you can see there, the water quality is too low. So if I go and put in... Where are you, my little friends? I'm gonna put just all the crabs in there. There they go, perfect. Why are you angry? They're angry for some reason. I don't know. I don't think they like being with each other. So we'll have one of them. And he'll just be outnumbered heavily by the crabs. Remember crabs. Music's pretty good too. But yeah, you get you get the, essentially the idea. But we're going to actually leave this. How do I leave? Okay, cool. So this is a, the third son of mission. So what do you want? And then on the right, it tells you like your objectives and stuff like that. And once you finish everything, you can actually move to the next level or you can kind of just chill out in the new last aquarium. I didn't save it all. It doesn't take that long to do the missions. Different animals. So it's kind of neat. That's an interesting high tank. So what do we got in here? Put a moray eel in there. Put a flamey fish in there. And we're gonna put a crab. I'm gonna put an angel fish in there. And sooner or later, all these guys will just murder the hell out of each other. Because, you know, fish crazy. 
Oh, and it needs research points and all that kind of fun stuff. So put some snaky grass in there too. But yeah, that's usually I'd be planning out stuff a lot more, but you get the essential idea. You're just kind of taking care of all these fishies and all that kind of stuff. But anyways, I am Zero Jetty. This is Mega Aquarium. I think it's pretty neat. I've always had a sort of soft spot for these theme park games ever since the original theme park on computer when I played way, way back. If you have any questions, ask down below. Uh, the If you're confused about anything, like I said before, the tutorial is pretty great and it gives you continual tutorials as you unlock new stuff like that armored fish one. It kind of explained to it what about what's kind of happening and all that. So like that puffer fish. Maybe normally he'd get like because he's like a, a size two fish, he'd be eaten by the more ale, but because he had the armor, the more ale would not bother him. Thank you and have a nice day. Goodbye. <laughs>